I wanted to do something, actually, this is kind of important that I wanted to bring up for the people at home before we really get the show rolling along. Okay. Our show, ladies and gentlemen, whether you know it or not, is closed captioned. That's right. This is a, a great thing. It allows our hearing-impaired viewers to enjoy the show. But I think it's something our other viewers may know nothing about. That They may not know we have closed captioning. And, and yeah, I, and even if they do know about it, they may not have experienced it. So they're, they're not familiar with it. Exactly. Right. So tonight, I thought we'd do, and we've done this before, We'll do another comedy bit with visible closed captioning. That's right. This way everyone else can see this great thing that they've been missing. They'll know we have this service, and they won't take it for granted. You ready right. to go? I, I would love to do this. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, tonight's comedy piece is called Celebrity Hairbrushes. Great. First up, ladies and gentlemen, it's uh, Don King's hairbrush right here. <laughs> hmm. I, I've been I've been looking for one of those actually. That's right, yeah. Next up, folks, Burt Reynolds hairbrush. Isn't that fun? Yeah. See? Oh, oh, and there it went right off. Yeah. Oh. It's yeah. It's softer kind of a bristle. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, he's having a good time with that. That thing came right off. Wow. Actually. And that's fun right there. So oh. hang on to that. We got right over here. Now this is fun. This is Pavarotti's. Smells like Burt Reynolds. There you go. Pavarotti's hairbrush right here. It's got bacon well, in it and stuff. It's got bacon on it. Yeah. Sure. Which is fun. You know, you have little shreds of bacon in there because Pavarotti is. He's very large. He's very large. Yeah. He's I, I think you could even call him fat. You could call him fat, yeah. which is great. It would, it it's would, terrific. I wouldn't be surprised. Exactly. People would. would that's the sense of that joke right mm -hmm. there. Is that he's fat. Now, right here, you want to take a look at this one this. over here. Yeah, we got actually here. This is uh, Michael Jackson right here. Here, smell it. Stop it, here, Billy. Look what you did. She. I'm not sorry. You're going to have to take another shower. Oh. So am I. I'm on my way with you myself. Wait a minute. You said this up, didn't you? It's not so hard. Right here. Now, we don't know what this is actually here. This is Mickey Rourke right here. This is ah. And uh, so it's kind of a fun Mickey Rourke. I, 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 when I was there, I had to use one of those for Oh, really? Months. That's yeah. terrible. Yeah. 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 That's awful. Yeah. No. You know what I mean? And, of course, this is one of those jokes where Mickey Rourke, of course, the joke is... He's filthy. Exactly. Yeah, he's not very well kept. Not, not at all. No. Kempt, you know, like K-E-M-P-T. No, exactly. Yeah. That's a good, that's kempt, a good you know? point, actually. So he's well kempt. Kempt. Well, You know, and you can yeah. sort of do one of these things yeah, right here, actually. Yeah. Which is well, a really good. Or a little further down. <laughs> there you go. That's a good joke. And so, and you've got that yeah. right thing right there. Now this one actually it. is still in the box right here, and I don't know what the joke quite is with the what fact that it's in the box. What do you think this is? Oh, I, maybe. Do you have any idea at all? Dracula. Something like that. I don't know. I didn't like really that. get. I didn't get the joke for this yeah. one. Exactly. Oh, it's probably George Clooney. Oh well, there you go. I mean, just to throw a name. Just because exactly. Just because right, any right, celebrity right. name in this situation would yeah. be just great, and people love that. You know, people really do. And the fact that it comes in its own box, I think. Well, that's great. That's a really nice brush. Exactly. You know? And uh, there we go. And then uh, this one, now we did this one before. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But I thought we'd revisit it again because it did well. Right. You know what I mean? And it's actually, it's kind of like a, you know. Oh, let's see. And it's losing its bristles like a too. It's shooting yeah. its quills out. Now this one know? right here, I thought this was a funny one. Patrick Stewart, you know, from Star Trek. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you know, he's bald head and it yeah. hits it. And then there's the joke there is that he's bald. Right. So why or would he even have a brush? It'd be good uh, for somebody with a mohawk if you know, just yeah. comb the middle. Yeah, exactly. Know? Right. There you go. It'd and it takes good care for, of like, just the some... sides. Yeah, right. Exactly. And so you got a, uh, you got a good joke there. Now, let me see. Let me see. Well, well Shatner's. One. Well, Shatner's. No, we had a good time with that. Yeah. There's nothing better than a hairpiece joke. Oh, People no, love no, a hairpiece no. joke. They're the greatest. Yeah. I don't know. They're I think it went over great, too, myself. Uh -huh. I think it's one of those things that just work terrifically. Like, right. you know, what you do. Yeah. It just works great. There we go. And I think it's just one of those... That's what the audience wants to do. I guess this went over great. We'll take a break. We'll be right back with Rosie O'Donnell.